Bucket loads of experience in various drag racing eliminators for a long, long time. In this particular class or category of drag racing, you have to give the huge advantage to Morris Allen for in that uh, on that red machine, I should say, for Milwaukee. Man, he is so, so cagey. The familiar red leathers. Leathers? The Bet. 400 Thunder CEO <laughs> in the 400 <laughs> Thunder <laughs> left hand lane. He's got two different shirts going on at the moment. The uh, transport of the trailer at the moment resembles more of a wardrobe this weekend. <laughs> the amount of shirt changes he's done. He's doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes to ensure the future of this 400 Thunder series. J-Mac. Not much of a burnout there from Morris Allen. You're going to have to look at his first 60 feet and wonder, is he going to be able to stick it to the track? I don't know. What do you guys think? I think he'll still be able to stick it to the track, uh, potentially enough. But Learmoth was so good in his housekeeping and his start line behaviours in that first round of eliminations did a really, really good job against Scotty White, who's no mug when it comes to pro bike competition here as part of the 400 Thunder Championship. Well, we say 200ths of a second was the win for Learmoth before. He's got a tough opposition here. The Vance and Hines Suzuki of Morris Allen. We look behind. The multi-time Australian champ as he inches in, waiting for Learmoth to bump in. Oh, oh no! It's going to be a pedal fest, is it? Is Who's going to grab a trouble? gear? Who's going to do this? Happen? He's got to try and find a gear. Someone is going to have to move to the end here. Crack the whip. Who's going to do it? Morris, oh. Morris Allen still has noise. He's tried to get it into gear, but a massive, massive zing. Give us some encouragement. <laughs> Ryan Learmoth is ball. running. Who's going to do this? He's running. Chase him. Ladies and gentlemen, it is quite literally a Flintstones extravaganza! Go for it! <laughs> Liam Hoff is going to get the half track here. Morris Allen is in the lead. We're talking about a 40 metre <laughs> lead. Ryan Liam Hoff is not giving up. I'm glad Mo didn't have that extra serve for dinner tonight. He's going to have to push. He's on the sticky stuff. The engine has died on Morris Arms. He's killed it. <laughs> Either that or it's run out of fuel. Oh, my goodness. And I'm about me. to as well. They've run out of leg power. Oh, this is not something you could have prepared for. No, and you're puffing, J-Mac, just seeing this. But it, they have a thought for these guys trying to manhandle a bike down to the finish line. I reckon we could squeeze two commercial breaks in here and come back and still wouldn't be at the finish line with this right now. Keep the encouragement up, folks. They're don't, still not there. Don't worry, Morris Allen, Ryan Limont. This is about to hit social media and will hit views in the six, if not seven figures. This is ridiculous. This is a drag race. They might get some shoe sponsors out of this. <laughs> this is crazy. These bikes are worth, what, $150,000? <laughs> and it's come down to this. This is incredible. He's almost there. Limont is reeling him in. Come on, Perth, make some noise, cheer them on, let's hear you, this is crazy! Learmoth has on, closed the gap it. like you wouldn't believe! <laughs> Here he comes! It is incredible! The reaction time advantage was 0-2-3 to Learmoth, but he had a big shut-off, shall we say, the start line. Look at this, they're almost there! Itching, itching, Morris Allen for Milwaukee, he's about to hit the finish line, beam! Now for the most epic 65 <laughs> second pass you've ever seen in your life! Ridiculous! Oh my goodness, I've never seen anything like that in any form of motor racing ever. Oh, you've got to have a chat to them when they come back. Oh wow! <laughs> that is crazy! Unbelievable! And there comes Learmoth! <laughs> come on Perth, make some noise for our pro bike stars, they are tough! Mark for victory, 11 and a half seconds <laughs> Good after all of that. Oh, I think Momo wants to have a...